What's up, folks? How you feeling out there? I want to talk about the fattest woman in the world. You know, the fattest woman got to quit it because she was too fat to commit to crime. Now, I know a lot of you thinking like, Kevin, what the fuck are you talking about? So you telling me if I get fat, I can kill people and get off? No, that's not the case at all. Hear me out, okay? Now, she was acquitted from the charge because her defense came up with this theory, which sounds pretty reasonable to me because this is the fattest woman we're talking about. And as you look at that picture, you know, you say, damn, look, it, you know, you wouldn't really have nothing positive to say about a human being like that. You know, but I am going to say a few positive things about her. You know, this chick right here, um, first of all, she was accused of killing her nephew. Okay. You know, and um, once everything got down to the nitty gritty, she didn't kill him. She told the police she fell on him and he died, which sounds reasonable. If somebody like that fall on me, I'm like, what the fuck? You know, I'm like, I'm scared for my life, okay? But autopsy showed that the little boy was struck in the head or whatnot. And if you're looking at her arms, you know, she was not able to strike him because her arm was so fucking fat. That's the theory that the defense came up with, the prosecutor and everybody ran with that. That sounds true to me. You know, now, this woman right here was just trying to protect her sister because her sister did this shit. Her sister killed her own son, which was the dumbest thing in the world. Don't fucking protect your sister. She killed him. You know, this woman got a big heart. You know, and I'm not saying that to be funny. You know, she might got a big ass leg, a big, big leg, I should say. But she got a big heart because she was raising, you know, her sister kids for her, looking out for them the best way she could. Now, on the flip side, you know what you need to do, sweetheart, with the big heart of yours? You need to put some of that energy into yourself because right now you is your life threatening right now. You know, biggest woman in the world, you almost as big as your bed. You know, it don't look like she's going to swing and hit nobody. The only thing it looks like she's going to knock out is a pound of hot wings, you know? See, you can say a bunch of negative things about the woman. I can sit here and do it all fucking day, but I'm not going to do it to her. But I am going to say this to you, sweetheart. I think that you should motivate yourself by, you know, I don't know, getting a trainer or something in that nature because you save, you're trying to save a life, you're helping out those kids, which is good. Save yourself. That's what you need to do because you will be dead with your nephew. You will if you don't get up and do something about that. You know, I appreciate the fact that you went out your way, you know, as big as you is to care for somebody else because it's hard. You know, it looked like she need help with everything that she do. And for her to open up her heart and help out those kids, that's cool right there. That's really cool, you know. And even try to take up for her pathetic-ass sister who should get hit upside the head with a fucking hammer six or seven times. But I'm about to get out of here. Links in the description box. Um, until next time, you guys have a good one. Deuces.